Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I made a calendar using LaTeX. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to do it. Keep watching this video up to the end. Hello, this is Master Your Academic Skills channel. In this channel, we are talking about how to master your academic skill. If you like this kind of video, be sure to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell ring to get notified when my new videos are uploaded. In this series of videos, I'm going to talk about how to make some projects using LaTeX. In fact, I'm going to talk about how to plot some advanced graphs or draw some figures using LaTeX. If you are not in advanced level in using LaTeX, just follow my lead and do it step by step as I'm going to show you. As a first project, I'm going to show you how to make a calendar uh, in LaTeX. Okay, let's get started. We start, oh, we start off with document class stand, stand alone. This kind of document class gives us the results in a whole PDF. Okay. And we need to use a package tick z. Yes, also we need to use tick z library. So use tick z library calendar. Calendar, yes. Let's set color of different season. Let color let color color let uh, winter. We have winter in blue. Uh, let me copy and paste here. Winter, spring, summer, and fall. Okay, let me change the green into black with 60 degree. This kind of command change the uh, green into black. And for summer I have orange orange yeah and for the fall I have red um, set new count new count count my count my count and begin the main body in fact the begin the uh put it into the uh documents begin we need the tick z picture and with an option transform shape transform shape every every day yes slash every day slash the style I'm gonna define the style so anchor anchor mid let's put it in the middle the font the font size six and uh, six x skip it's okay and the and the select form here is the option and now oh, let let me put it in the next line to organize it let's add a node yes we need a node and uh, within its braces we have uh, let me uh, show the number of year in a huge size okay the year this command helps you to compile uh, the calendar in its current year and a semicolon okay semicolon and for uh, for each month i'm gonna i'm gonna declare the the color of the month is for each month uh, slash backslash month color yes in 
I'm going to show each uh, month in a specific color. One slash uh, winter. Okay, winter. And uh, two winter. Yes. Three summer. Summer. Three, four, five, summer, four, five, summer, and uh, four, five, six. I have spring, summer. Ah, oh. yes, yes, yes. No, 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 spring is three, four, five, yes. Uh, summer is six summer summer six seven eight and nine is fall ten is fall and eleven is fall and uh, for the last one I have twelve winter that's it let me check the spelling uh, I don't see anything special okay and let's open new braces here set my count equal to the month month and advance like such my count okay by minus one multiply multiply my count my count by 30 and advance my count by minus 90 and a calendar calendar yes calendar at if I I'm gonna Define the circle, the year, uh, the year, a circular with 6.4 centimeter radius. Yes, mm -hmm. with an option, yeah, uh, dates equals the year dash month month dash or one two the year dash month month oh month two should not have backslash up to the last okay up to the last and we need some ifs if they are month equal one equal one yes equal one month equal one I need the braces the color is month color month color and tick the month code yes take the month code um, um, okay another if is for Sunday Sunday uh, I, I like to uh, comp I like to show them in red color and another if for all I need a bracer. Yes, my count equal one. Advance we need my count by minus PGF calendar current day. Okay, and multi multiply 
multiply multiply my count my count by 11 advance we need new my my count by 90 and pgf transform shift pgf transform shift braces pgf polar point polar yeah i like to put it into a polar circular and my count yes with a 1.4 centimeters radius okay and i had this one and this one that is it guys let me compile it okay oh i have a problem here let me check where i where i did wrong uh, let me put it into the new line uh, aha. calendar at not the year the my count my count let me compile it now uh, yes here it is here it is the final result you see that the we have the calendar as we expected before and let me let me show you what what happened uh, into the folder uh, folder containing the original source of the text you see if you if you compile your text file using the uh, standalone document class you have a pdf file okay let me open the pdf file to show you how the standalone document works Open, open yes you see the uh, the document class uh, outputs the final results in a, a whole pdf file and you can use this pdf file uh, in your tech file and in, in fact you can input it into the your tech file or print it uh, it's uh, with itself and uh, that's it that's it for this project and if you like this video give a thumbs up to this video and be sure to subscribe my channel and click, and click on the bell ring to get notified when my new videos are uploaded thank you for watching